Agantala, the captain, who was sent crashing after he'd played the ball. Here's Reid. The tackle came from Adair, and then from the blonde-haired Nakvai, Mateus. Bayern with so much more experience of European competition than this Everton side. Bye. Hey there. Just a moment space for Peter Reid. Everton delivering the ball to the front players quickly from the back of this second leg of the semi-final. Bayern's position at the top of the Bundesliga is much more precarious than Everton's at the top of the first division. Bayern only lead by one point over Werder Bremen. Reid protests that he was caught. The referee allowed the game to go on. Bracewell, Adair had committed himself and ended on the ground. And then goes down a second time with perhaps something of the revenge motive about it. Sent towering into the air. Gray. And he lashed out at Klubler in retaliation. Kurgle. His early miss looking more important now difficulties Reed here's Stephen and Reed winning it back from Kurgle here's Reed Ratcliffe wanted to join in thought better of it and Reed goes on great great advantage played by the referee and Bracewell squanders it after Reid has set him up. Flugler could hardly have done it better. Here is Flugler, but Reid Sterner in the tackle. Sharp slipped at the crucial moment. Brought away by Ada. It was Reid's tackle. But Everton lead. And here's Peter Reid, and Sharp is offside. Andy Gray has shown himself the man for the big occasion once more. And Gray, was there a butt from Tremler? In the second period, here's Reid. Corner off Labu. Rolled up their sleeves. And refused to be beaten. They're through to their first European final. Andy Gray's crucial goal, the second of Everton's three, and the unique treble is very much on at the expense of the similar ambitions of Bayern Munich.